Hello girls and guys ladies and gentlemen welcome back to Robot Thoughts Zero to Hero series Vision Intelligence on Jetson Nano All right guys so let's take a look what we learned so far so beginning of this series uh I I I created multiple lessons uh, you know starting from the scratch of Linux terminals how to use the terminal commands and then i introduced you to python the very basics of python right we haven't got into the advanced level of python which we will be doing uh, at a later stage so i am sure by now you got a hang of you know uh, using linux terminal on jetson nano and also started doing some basic python programming right uh and then i i showed you a couple of uh, you know aspects of artificial intelligence using the webcam what kind of you know uh, uh, the vision processing you can do capturing the image capturing uh, uh, you know uh, the faces and stuff like that and do some processing and throw that particular data in an analytical way right and we also did bunch of object detection and image recognition stuff using the existing pre trained neural network from nvidia jetson inference engine right now where are we heading to guys we had covered quite a lot of stuff now this video is just an introduction about what we are going to do next right so i am going to start building autonomous robot step by step in a systematic way and start integrating some of the artificial intelligence stuff what we learned in the in the recent lessons it's it's a pretty low level but we will get into more and more and more advanced right so what we are going to do is uh, i will introduce you to several concepts of robotic operating system which is ros ros you know on jetson nano how we are going to do that and we will also talk about how to install lidar okay lidar is nothing but it's 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 called light detection and ranging it's a kind of radar i am going to talk about this and then we will also install intel t265 okay this is this is a tracking camera which has got a inbuilt imu now what is an imu i am going to talk about that as well and then all this stuff is going to get integrated into your jetson nano along with some of the object detection models what we already did and then we will bundle this together into a four wheel drive uh, uh, robot right so i made a small chassis so let me just switch my video all right great so this is this is what i'm going to build it guys and i'm going to show you step by step how to do it and kind of thing so what we will do is first we will so so this particular chassis has got uh, four dc motors with encoders built in encoders i am going to talk about encoders and how it works and kind of thing how to configure the encoders and such like that and then we will set up our jetson nano here and also we will be using an arduino Arduino is basically going to be used to drive your motors and which is going to be connected through the serial port into the USB of Jetson Nano all right and then i am going to set up a small deck like this okay uh, with a spacer with with a lengthy uh, uh, with a lengthy spacer here a brass spacer and then i am going to install this so that this particular top deck can hold your T 265 the tracking camera from intel and this is going to be mounted here and then on top of this there is going to be another deck okay i again have four different spaces uh, 3d printed uh, with a long screw inside and i am going to mount that here on top of this this is where your lidar is going to sit all right oops so this is where it's going to be mounted like this and then we will do the entire configuration your battery initially we'll use the adapter uh, but later on i'll show you how to fix the battery and uh, start doing it so guys it's 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 going to be pretty lengthy uh, lesson all right so it's 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 going to take a probably about another 15 20 videos because it's going to be very detail in depth <coughs> and once this is done 
you are going to remotely control the bot through your web browser <coughs> autonomously it's going to move autonomously you are going to give the command from your system and then you can do multiple other aspects in this bot you know guys jetson nano is a powerful device right and you are going to make this robot move around either indoor or on the outdoor environment and and do some you know uh, you are going to solve some problem or you are going to build some applications on top of this do a lot of things lot of things so this is going to be very basic foundation fundamental for anyone who's getting into robotics and artificial intelligence as a fresh without any knowledge without any skills right so this is going to be hands on i'm going to teach you one by one line by line command configuration setting up the terminal commands and the python codes to execute some of this stuff packages and stuff so all this is going to be very intensive detail so be patient guys i am going to be back soon we will start building some autonomous bot and make it work all right guys have a great day do give me a thumbs up and i am going to be back soon see you then bye bye